Hey YouTube, thanks for checking out my channel and today I'm going to go over more tools that I'm using in the garage. Basically this is a small series that I'm doing and it's going over tools that I use every day in my kind of repairs and that's small engine repairs. This crane, it's a handy handy item to have. Now this was originally designed to be bolted in the bed of a pickup truck. However, all you have to do is get some concrete anchors, mount it in the ground, and you're going to have yourself a very versatile piece of equipment. Now in this case, this one is listed as a thousand pounds if the boom is set in this position and 400 pounds here. Now that's really all I need to lift. I knew that I wasn't going to lift a mower off the ground. Even if I lifted the front of the mower um, up to some extent, it, it, this does a great job in its fully extended position. No problems at all. Now I wanted to show you though, I put a little short handle on here so I could use that as the jack and th this is actually the handle that comes with it. Um, there's also this here which I have yet to use and what this does is once the weight of the item is being supported by the jack, this is to help you turn the jack in the direction that you need it to go. Now I've got this loosened up quite a bit but you can get it to where that part right there snugs it up once you get it in position. But I keep that loose so I can spin it around. Now if you can imagine that I have a tractor that's up on the table already and I need it to be lifted so I can, let's say, remove the transaxle. It's really nice because this lift will go up considerably to where it can do it. Now at this point, I'd probably be reaching over and hooking to the bottom side of the mower. And you can see from this point on how high this jack can go. Now I don't know about you, but I can't imagine needing to lift my mower this high off of the deck of this table. So what I normally do is I use a strap. That way I don't have any chances of scratching the paint. And it secures a little better because I can actually make two lifting points instead of just one. So the other nice thing is if you're working on the ground and you need to lift. So let me show you that real quick. So again, if you're working on the ground here and you have a mower that needs to be worked on in this bay because your table's tied up with something else, you just swing the jack around and it can be lifted from this point. I'm going to go ahead and lower it and we'll uh, get it close to where it'd probably be whenever I start. There you go. I think it's a really cool, cool item. Okay, so they're going to have a few that you can buy whenever you get into that link that I've got below. Just do your shopping. Decide which one's going to work for you best. There's one that's 1,000 pounds in this position and 250 here. Uh, there's also another one that's 2,000 pounds and 1,000 pounds here. I really think that um, for most small engine work, um, 400 pounds is just fine. Um, again, they're all about the same design. Uh, they got a swivel here. You're going to come with a handle. I'm not sure how necessary this is. I have never used that, but I guess it would help if something heavy was on the front and it needed moved around. And then, uh, of course, you've got a um, swivel plate that you can mount to the ground. Again, with just anchors. That's all I've ever used is just uh, concrete anchors. And this does see some water, and it is getting a little bit rusty. But I've never had any problems with the way that it feels. It doesn't make any noise. And uh, it's been a really good product. So, again, the link's down below. And continue to watch for my other videos on other items in the shop. Thanks. 